professional truck driver meets many demands and challenges on the road. These may include poor weather conditions, traffic slowdowns, as well as tight schedules. These factors often seem to combine and are usually accepted as all in a day's work. Another factor that may be added to a commercial driver's workday is truck and trailer inspection at an ODOT way station or port of entry. These inspections should not be viewed as an interruption or impediment to getting the job done, but rather as a supplement, a needed addition to continued safety and success for the professional driver. Whenever roadway signage directs you to enter a way station, Approach slowly and follow the directional prompts as needed. Pay particular attention to open lane signals and specific reader board messages. The work being done by the motor carrier enforcement officers is essential to the safety and maintenance of our highway system. They are not only checking for legal weight, length, licensing and registration, but also for any equipment or operations that may negatively impact safety for all members of the traveling public. Natalie, does he have a decal? Nope. Would you stop him, please? Absolutely. Thank you. If you are directed to stop and are requested by a motor carrier enforcement officer to report for inspection, Hello, how are you? the one thing you can Mind be assured of in advance is that you will be treated as a fellow professional with courtesy and respect. Sir, my name is Todd, I'm with ODOT. I'm doing level one inspection today, and I know you didn't have a CVSA decal on your window. What I'm having you do is pull around over there to the inspection bay to bay A. Okay. Right. Follow the signs. The person inside will direct you what to do, okay? All right. Thank you, sir. Remember, this inspection is for everyone's safety. By following directions and doing what is requested, you will minimize any delay. You will soon be on the road again if you and your vehicle are operating safely and in compliance with Oregon's rules and regulations for commercial transport. The following video will give you an idea of what the inspection process looks like and how it can be beneficial to your work. Okay, sir, what I'm gonna do is walk to the end of the bay and I'm gonna guide you in, so pay attention to my hand gestures, okay? Once I get you up there and stop, what I'm gonna have you do is just keep your foot on the brake, don't set your parking brake because I'm gonna chalk your wheels. All right, All right. thank you. I'm gonna go ahead and chalk your wheels. I'll be right back. You can go ahead and turn the vehicle off. Sir, I need to get some information off the panel. Can you open the door for me, please? Yes, sir. And the GVWR is 53 3. Where did you start your trip today? Salem, Oregon. And where are you headed to? Portland, Oregon. Portland. And what's your cargo today, sir? Uh, ice cream. Ice cream. Perfect. And do you have a bill waiting for that? Yes, sir. Can I look at that, please? Yes, sir. And how about your license and your medical card, please? And are you running a paper log or an electronic log? Electronic log. OK. I'll have to look at that here in just a few minutes. Is that OK? Yep. Perfect. And the odometer reading? 150,000. Perfect. All right, just say title way back in a moment, okay? Yep. Thank you, sir. Yep. We're gonna start the walk around process right now. So I'm gonna start up front, work my way down the driver's side. When I get to the rear, we'll check the lights at the rear and then I'll work my way back up the passenger side. And then when I'm done there, I'll go underneath. So what I need you to do now is go ahead and turn your key in the on position and turn all your lights on for me, please. Yes, sir.
High beam. Back to low. Left turn. Right turn. Good. And your four ways. Four ways off. Good. Okay, sir, what I'm going to have you do now is just go ahead and rock your steering wheel back and forth. I'm going to check your pitman arm. Good, Good. Thank you. Okay, if you would, watch me in the mirror when I get to the back. We'll do the lights back there. That's good. Okay, I'm going to go between the truck and the trailer, check your airlines, and check your fifth wheel, okay? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Sir, go ahead and give me a left turn and a right. Good. Four ways. Four ways off. Break and release. Good. You can go ahead and shut all, shut all your lights off. I'm just about finished with the walk around. Let me finish up this front tire. I'll be around to talk to you about the rest of the inspection, okay? Thank you. Okay, sir, the walk around's complete. Everything looks great. I'm gonna go underneath. I'm gonna check your brakes and your suspension. Make sure everything looks good. What's your air pressure at right now? 120 PSI. 120, perfect. Okay, once I get underneath, I'll be, I'll work my way to the rear of the vehicle. Once I get to the rear, I'm gonna yell brake. I'm gonna yell, go ahead and give me a full foot brake and hold until I say release. Yes, sir. All right, thank you.
Can you rock your steering wheel for me one more time, please? Good, thank you. Driver, full foot brake and hold, please. And release, please. Can you open the door for me, please? Thank you, sir. Okay, what we're gonna do now is your low air warning device. What I'm gonna have you do is turn the key in the on position, pump your brakes down, and once your low air warning device activates, tell me what pressure you're at. Yes, sir. Okay, go ahead and turn the key on. Good. Sir, what's your pressure at? 90 PSI. 90 PSI, perfect. Go ahead and turn the key off and come on down. We're going to check your tractor protection valve now. Yes, sir. Do you have your gloves? Yes. Sir. You'll want those.
go ahead and pop each one of your glad hands off for me, please. Okay, what I'm going to have you do now is step up in the driver's seat and hit your brake. Yes, sir. Okay, go ahead and brake. Perfect. And you can come hook these back up. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All right, sir, here's your license and your medical card and your bill of lading. Everything looked great. There's no violations on the truck or the trailer, so I'm going to issue CVSA decals for both vehicles. I'll go ahead and stick those on. Once I get them on, I'll guide you out of here and you'll be good to go, okay? And this is your copy of the inspection report. If you note there, it says no violations discovered. Just turn that into your company and they'll keep it for their records, okay? Well, thank you, as soon sir. as I get those decals put on, I'll escort you out of here, okay? Yes, sir. All right, thank you. Okay, sir, the CVSA decals have been placed on the truck and the trailer. Those are good for 90 days. All right, they also count as an annual inspection, so turn that inspection form into your company. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to guide you out of the truck inspection bay. Once I get you clear of the building, you're free to go, okay? Thank, Thank you. you. You have a good day. Thank you.